Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Leanne. That's Olivia. That's a little bit that you can see of her. And um, today she is going to be teaching me how to make a Coraline, it's a Coraline doll. And it's completely poseable, like everything on it moves. So that is what we are going to be doing. So now I'm going to make my skeleton. There's fires too. Do I need to make his triangle part? No, I already know. making the boom and then the leg. Do I need to do anything for the foot? A little circle. It's going to have to be a little circle because I didn't cut enough wire. Take your pliers. Take your pliers and use it to bend the end. Climb it to the end gently and Yep, that's good. That's perfect. That's perfect. Wait a minute, I gotta... Okay. You just want it like that. Mine's so gonna be you... short. <laughs> I mean, that's fine. It you don't matter. Have to bend. And I don't have now to what? <clears throat> twist <laughs> them together. The upwards ones just like twist them around each other. attach it to the other end by like twisting it on the other. Don't worry if it's a little wonky. It's fine. It's literally the armature. You don't want it to be overly wonky but like Ow! Shark piece. That's a shark pieces. This ain't twisting. <laughs> like it should. Do you want me to make it? No, I don't want to do it, but it's not twisting like it should. Wires. I can't twist it. I can't get it on there. Oh, why'd you put it funky in like that? You're gonna want to, yeah, fix it out so you don't stab yourself. Well, too late for that. I didn't stab myself. Um, 
whenever we do our clay, we're going to cover up the edges where it's like wired together with a little bit of clay. Just so it like stays. But I think we may cut the sharp ends of our wire with hot glue so it doesn't poke out the fabric. is harder to work with than the other wire was. Mm -hmm. And it's thinner and doesn't make sense. No, it should be easier. I got one foot huge and one foot <laughs> one leg is longer than the other. <laughs> Here's what I've got so far. It doesn't matter <laughs> if one leg's longer it's than fine. the other. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Your feet just aren't Not everybody's work. perfect. I'm not doing work. What else do I need to do? The arms. Yeah, for this, you're going to want to get a. I can put my stump. <coughs> Very long piece of wire here. Let me do that. It goes. Let me show you how to put it on. Don't, don't, don't just go for it. I just put it through here. Yeah, but you're gonna have to like and then twist it. Make sure it's just even. What I do is I twist it. Yeah, I twisted it. Opposite ways around the wire. Isn't the wire fun? No, not <laughs> at all. I'm having a big struggle here. Okay, I twisted it. All right, legs, stay like it's supposed to. It's down too far. Up there, right there. Give me a pliers I use. Yeah. Or a hammer. A hammer. It's in place. Oh, <laughs> right there. Hammer. If I can make it stay. I got a loop again at the bottom. Right. Yeah. I got a loop again. Yes. Just make sure you loop as much as you can. So, um. Oh. <laughs> Oops. What'd you do? I made mine too small. It actually works perfectly. Just now it's like this. Huh? <laughs> I want to work longer than the other two. <laughs> oh, I got a leg longer than the other. I got a arm longer than the other. Maybe my sketch is just really messed up. No, it's probably my cutting because your sketch looks pretty good. It's okay. I mean, like, she's gonna be a little wonky, but she's gonna look fine. 
Her be body fair. is done. No, it's not. There's more to The get skeleton's on. done, no, ain't it? No, it's not. Really? What else we gotta add? I mean, I guess, okay, we don't have to do it because it may be a little hard. What? Let's get out of the actual headpiece. Okay, but we can do no, that. No, we can just, no, I know what we'll do. That's fine. We can do the headpiece. No, I don't want to. <laughs> I know how. It's gonna be hard. No, it's not. Look, watch. <laughs> don't laugh at me. I'm getting this, and I know how to do this. It's just like whenever people say, look, watch, they mess up really badly. Watch, watch. I don't need that little piece. Give me some cutters. I have to cut some cutters right here. Okay, here's the head piece. Don't laugh. I don't need this one. I'm going to stay on the right. Okay, I know how I'm going to do this. Hold on. Watch. Shh. Watch. You know it's going to be a freaking small, right? Huh? <laughs> Especially to the to the actual head. I think that's gonna be too small. No. No. Okay. Watch. I ain't got a piece in here. Doing that may be easier for you, but I don't want to do mine like that. Maybe it's the other one in here. Hmm. I need four hands. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Are my rings suddenly way more impressive? Mm -hmm. Huh? Are my rings suddenly more impressive? Your what? The wire rings I make? Yes. This is what I make them with. This hey, I get it. Look. Oh, don't slide. I did it. Is it too small? Is it not? What? No! Okay. It's actually the right size. Okay, yeah, sure. I have my my head, my arms, my legs, my body. Okay, so she didn't now think I could do it. You can start making your tinfoil ball. You want it to be the size of your head. So like the size of my head? That's yeah. awful big. Yeah. Sure. Okay. I'm gonna back oh. you up. Why is the rolling pin here? I would explain it to you like that time. Make sure I can like Is that enough? No. That should be enough, right? Can right. you fit it through your head? Fit it through? It's got to go through? <laughs> That's supposed to be like the center of it. Uh -oh. <laughs> no, no, we are not My head comes off. So. <laughs> Don't laugh. I think it comes off. So. 
Oh, come on. I'm not a liar out of <laughs> Yep, see? Now, then. Almost. Because he's a liar. He put a force on it and it moves. Okay. Now, way ahead. Can I wrap another thing of tin foil around this? Yeah. Another thing of tin foil. I don't see why not. I just want to cover the wire this time. Okay. Yeah, I'll run out of tin foil. There's a whole other part. Yeah, I'm going to run out of tin foil. There's a whole other part. No, but I think that other thing's on the piece is. I'm almost done. I'm almost done with it too. I just need this much. Oh, ow! I don't want to do more. I just want to wrap this. Oh. Working at. There's nothing out there. How thin do I roll this? Um, relatively. Like, I'm still a little thick, but not too thin. I don't need it a little thick. You're gonna have to, just keep in mind, you're gonna have to indent your buttons. I know. So probably that much. Is that going to cover the heat? You can always make more. It's not going to cover. Well, here. I have to grab this a little bit more. Yeah. Grab more. So I got to mix more in with this and then roll it out again. Yeah. I'm sorry. This is kind of hard. I never saw it would be easy. Oh god. <laughs> Son of a biscuit eater. <laughs> <sighs> Is this the stuff that you had 25 pounds of? No. I have 25 pounds of air Now I gotta do this all over again. This is a workout. Yeah. Are you excited to realize how much work this actually is? Are you going into it thinking it'd be easy? I didn't go into it thinking it'd be easy. I know it's going to be hard. How You're long, making a doll. Do you remember how long it took me? I mean, it took you one day. It took me all day. So. Yeah. 
still pretty, pretty labor inducing. Fix it. I don't know why it's wobbling. Get cardboard and throw out the tea. Oh, this one leg over here short. Yeah, get get cardboard or something. I'm gonna wobble some. I don't mind. Your dad needs to fix the table. It's also like a table. A lot of tables are meant to support. Yeah, right. Table. And it's an old table. Mom has had this table since before you was born. At least the stuff are the same. Is my head bigger than yours? Probably. I don't know. I definitely use that much things a little. I ain't gonna roll my head around like that. <laughs> I told you that, that that idea I was I didn't want to go that way. I told you it was harder. And you're like, I got this. I know how this works. <laughs> I was like, okay. well, I'm gonna put the head on to where I don't have to roll it uh -huh. around. I just gotta stand up. <laughs> you should break the table. <laughs> I think that's good. I don't know if it's big enough. It is. <laughs> we are going to need to make a neck as well. Well, I'm going to make neck and all of this okay. one. Mine ain't going to look right. <laughs> look at mine. It's not gonna look right. I warned you, and you're like, I, I can't this. roll mine around. I warned you. And I got right. way too much slice. <laughs> I got way too much. I can make a whole body and everything. I had, this. Um, I had less clay than you did. <laughs> I had way less clay than you. My Aries too much gene done kicked in. Oh, it's kind of coming together. The extra clay. I have. <laughs> You're gonna have to cut that down. Oh my god. I gotta make a neck, right? <clears throat> so I'll keep the neck part. Hey, it's coming together. I can almost make a body out of clay, though. No. If I didn't want a potable. Let's see, where should I cut it for to keep a neck? You said a template. No, I'm saying where. Yeah, you can use a template here. Oh, you can cut it off in like a saw and you should make some set of intervals. There. Yeah, that's the clay I freaking added. Oh, actually, that's really good. 
Huh? Looks good. Mine. Yeah. No, mine. Oh, yours. I don't fucking know what yours looks like. Okay. Now for eyes. Can I see it? Mine. How do I should say for eyes? The head's a little wonky. Um, oblong. That's fine. Not quite round. That's okay. Here's what I have so far. All right, how do I eyes? Okay, you're gonna take your. You see how I have on the template where the eyes kind of should lay? Mm -hmm. Follow that, and you're gonna take your buttons and just impress them into where you want the eyes. Right there. And then you're gonna take this tool and get them out. Now we have eyes. I gotta make a nose, don't I? Okay, you follow this example as well. So you can actually visualize it. They're also roughly the same size. We're also gonna have to make ears. Do you wanna like wait on me to catch up? Okay, I'll do that. What are you still gotta do? Are we doing ears or noses first? Ears. Okay, how do I? Wait, man, I need a piece of wire for ears. Yeah. Okay, well, I need wire. This or the gold? Um, that one. I think mm -hmm. that's okay for this one for here. Mm hmm Okay, so what you're going to want to do is, um, before you make it, look. You're going to cut it bigger. Bigger? Yeah, you're going to want to get this tool and press it. To here? Yeah. Press it into your ball and then you're going to want to put your wire into that hole <clears throat> are you going to want to like shape your ear yeah okay let me know whenever you're ready there yeah So, what you're going to want to do is get a little ball of clay. I want to get the wire in. Okay, so now we got wires in the ear, in the ear holes. Okay, so we get a little bit of clay. <laughs> And roll it on into a ball. And then you're going to want to flatten it. And you see the ears on the doll. Just kind of like match it to them. Then it could have. Yeah. Here. Did you kind of like reference the ears on the ears holes on them? Well, can I do that after I cut in half? Well, you can might as well just do it now, make sure they're big enough so you don't have to like. Oh, yeah, them. I think they're big enough. I think they're big enough. Okay. So once you have your ears, you're going to want to take the dotting tool. And then I got to, like, kind of do my round area. Okay. You see how there's the ear line right there? Yeah. 
you're going to kind of want to take your drawing tool and make a little indention. Make sure you leave enough for like your toes. Because you're making a pile of willow blocks. I'm using the bigger side. Just Amazon. Okay. Go to your idea. Oh, do you want to do piercings or anything? No. No? Okay. Well then, you can just sell your hands here. Have them. So I earned enough to keep them in place. <coughs> I want to do some piercings. Just leave it to the back. I mean, you can if you want, but I'll lay the rest of this out. Mm -hmm. Yeah, baby. Now we have ears. <clears throat> now we gotta make a nose, right? Yeah. Um, what I did to make the nose is gonna look like a triangle. Oh, that's not Amazon. Now we have a nose. You want to make sure it stays attached. Take like the big end of your thing and just smooth out. Yeah, I'm trying to do that with Give it nostrils if you want. I don't. Um, yeah. and you can dot these lines. Yeah. Just kind of poke up in there and swivel around. That's what I'm gonna do. So now we have a nose, ears, it's got little nostrils, the lighting is terrible. Now the mouth, oh we got to do a mouth too, don't we? Yeah.
He gave yours a nose piercing. <laughs> so it's cool. Are you figuring out the mouth? Mm hmm. Gotta give that a little quick face swirl. That looks so far. Not too shabby for my first time. Trace. So I would like the paper. Yeah, I should be able to. Okay. okay, now we are working on the bodies. I'm going to take her little template that she drew earlier. And trace it onto here. And a sharpie. So I got to do two of them. You don't have to trace two of them. I mean, like, I would imagine you would just pin your fabric together. And cut around it. I'd rather trace two. Okay. You trace two. Just to make sure. <clears throat> okay, so there's that. That's a little upside down. There's that. So now I'm going to cut them out. Can you hear me? Do what? Oh, so if you want to take a fruit, fruit cutter. Oh, wow. So now we're just going to be working on sewing the bodies together and we will come back when that is done. Okay, I have finished on my body. So now I have to flip it. Don't know. Okay, I'll be right back. Thank you. Okay, now we have the body flipped, and I have my little guy, so I'm going to put him in. Honestly, since you're going to stop him, don't put the arms in yet. Don't put the arms in yet. No, so you can actually get the legs. So what you're gonna wanna do is like 
Okay, I've got his legs in. Now I'm gonna start stuffing him. Let's see. Okay, I've got cotton in here, and all I'm gonna do is stuff him, and then I will come back when I'm done. So now he is all stuffed, and as you can see, I have to um, sew up around the neck. And then we will come back again, and all we got to do is paint and do hair and make clothes. This has been an all-day thing. And now the little guy is done. Not completely, but he's stuffed, sewed, sewed up around everywhere. And... Now all we have to do is paint and make clothes for him. It's kind of cute. He's a little wonky, but he's kind of cute. Oh, I should have piled his skin a little bit. That's fine. He's got like fingernail markings in him. Here he is, she is, whatever. After the painting. Okay, here come. Okay. So I'm gonna take this little remote and just wrap until I get enough hair. I'm just going to glue the eyeballs on, maybe. I don't think it's still heated up enough. There we go. What is this? Stuff for my jam tomorrow. That wasn't hot enough. Stuff for your what? Jam. Jam. That white bowl, is that left over this? Yeah. Just the, the plastic wrap. That's left over that. You see, I have way and that's made in red. Mm -hmm. You may want to sketch it out with a pencil. The hairline. Oh, so you yeah. know where you're putting your hair. Eyeballs are in. Okay, I'm going to go tediously add all this hair, and then I will come back. Now, she has hair. And tomorrow, we will give her a haircut and make her some clothes. And do a little more painting on her face. Okay, it is several days later, but there is the finished doll. She actually turned out kind of cute. Even though she's a little goofy looking, she turned out kind of cute. And I hope that y'all enjoyed this video. And I will see you in the next one. Until then, always remember, you are loved, you are beautiful, you are strong, you are brave, and most important, you belong. I hope everyone's having a wonderful day.